yourself. I'm just putting a flea collar on you, not giving you a bath. <laughs> Man's best friend, indeed. Poor Marcella. Fido is real frisky today. Yeah, and I don't understand why he doesn't like this flea collar. It looks like a real jeweled necklace. Well, it is quite unusual. And it does look good on me. Oh, that is a matter of opinion. Well, in my opinion, that's the biggest hole I've ever seen. What a mess. You're right, Andy. Let's go fill it in for Marcella right now. You and your big opinion. Wait! There's something down there! It's just an old lamp. But what if it's gold? Real gold! Don't be ridiculous. How many people leave gold lamps lying around, hmm? Don't be such a grump, Grouchy Bear. Time is running out. Now, how am I going to grant my master's last wish? Wow! It's a magic lamp! Are you a genie? Of course! Oh, <laughs> there it is! <laughs> oh, Allah be praised! I thought I'd never find it. <gasps> hey! Oh, what's being sewn? <laughs> for a dumb old flea collar. If you want the collar, it's yours. Yeah, we just want to go home. Gee, maybe they know the way. <gasps> See those intruders! Oh no, it's a trap! We better get out of here. No, wait! It's time to put a lid on these guys. <laughs> Everywhere, sir, and there's no sign of them. They must have given us the slip. Come on! Boy, was he ever an ugly king! Well, you're not exactly sleeping beauty yourself now, are you? How are we gonna get home? The same way we got here. Oh, my new master! 
<laughs> this is indeed a glorious day. How may I serve you? How about three wishes? Why, of course. You possess the lamp. Your wishes are my command. But you didn't give us any wishes before. You nabbed Raggedy Cat instead. A truly unfortunate situation. But I had to complete Princess Clea's last wish. Gee, if I could wish for anything, I'd wish for a ten-layer chocolate cake. Not me. I'd wish to see that princess again. I have a feeling she would have made me her royal cat. As you wish. Just call when you want to use your last wish. Do you see what you've done? We've only got one more wish left. Oh, I wish, I wish. Uh, we'd better save that wish so we can get home. What am I going to do? I need Raggedy Cat and the collar for a very worthy cause. I assure you. I don't mind. I'm sure Princess Cleo is telling the truth. Besides, anyone who likes cats can't be all bad. Well, I guess we can stay for a little while. What's this all about? So you see, Father was Pharaoh of this land, but now that he's gone, a new ruler must be named. That's easy. Well, as his daughter, you should be queen. Uh, or my twin sister, Nephra. Naturally, my father couldn't decide between us. Oh, great. Double trouble. Shh, quiet. I want to hear the rest of Clea's story. My father said that only the person pure of heart can receive the jeweled scepter. And the person with the scepter becomes queen. Right. These hieroglyphics tell all about it. I know I must have the sacred collar of the cat to release the scepter, but I haven't been able to figure out where to find it. Why didn't you use one of your wishes from the genie to get this scepter thing? Because that would be cheating. It says so right here. That's right. My father's wishes must be obeyed. I'm sure Nephra feels the same way, too. So, my sister thinks she has the sacred collar of the cat. Well, so do I. We must stop that little twerp, Dirac. Be quiet, you. Do you have a plan, your highness? Of course. I want that magic lamp. Then I'll make sure the genie takes me right to the jeweled scepter. This will be the end of my goody two sandaled sister and her friends. Well, what does it say? Well, I think it means we have to find the pyramid that sits atop the two hump tail next to a river. I think. Oh boy, we're in for trouble. I bet we don't even have a map. Hmm. I don't think we need one, Grouchy Bear. It sounds like the pyramid on the other side of the tombs of Luxor. Tombs? <laughs> Maybe I should stay behind. With us around, you have nothing to worry about, Raggedy Cat. Oh, that's very reassuring, Andy. What are we waiting for? The only way to the pyramid is through the tombs. See, it doesn't look so bad, Raggedy Cat. You are worried over nothing. Maybe. And maybe not. What's that? Someone is trying to stop us. I'm afraid you might be right. And I'm so sorry I've gotten you into this. Not nearly as sorry as we're going to be. They escaped every one of your traps, Durek. A momentary problem, I promise you, my princess. They will not exit the tomb. I guarantee you. You'd better be right this time. I want that lamp. Now, which way do we go? I don't know. Maybe Raggedy Dog can sniff out the safest corridor. 
Sorry, rock all smells the same to me. Oh, great. What a time for your sniffer to get choosy. But a wonderful opportunity for me to take the genie's magic lamp. Hand it over. <gasps> Derek! You know him? He works for my sister Nephra. But she couldn't be behind these accidents, would she? I don't think she's ruling out the red carpet for us. <gasps> there! and her friends like this. Hungry, my pets? Well, you won't be for long. Raggedy dog, your nose is cold. My nose isn't cold. Not neither. Then... will be very happy. Very happy indeed. Now that I have the lamp, it's only a matter of time before the scepter is mine and I am made queen. Oh, it's so sad that my sister and those raggedy-looking creatures won't be here to see it. <laughs> For that genie to know who he's working for now. <laughs> I am now the owner of the lamp, and I demand that you grant me my wishes. Who? Listen, you little weasel. Grant me my wishes and take me to the jewel scepter, or else. All right, all right. Keep your royal turban on. Wishes take time, you know. I have to get in the mood. Come on! What's taking you so long? Oh, yeah, it's coming. I can feel it. Hey, you're not the genie. You're one of those raggedy friends of my sister. God! Grab him! Gotcha! Yes, well, you will never get me to tell you that they are headed for the Great Pyramid. Oh, my. Good. Now that we know where they are, finding them won't be hard. Mm. <sighs> oh, I hope your plan works, Anne. Oh, no telling what Nephra may do to Grouchy Bear. Nephra won't hurt Grouchy Bear until she finds us and the genie. By that time, you'll have the scepter. 
I hope you're right. This is weird. There aren't any doors. Really do. Uh, 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 uh. 
You're not going to get away with this. I'll have my magic lamp. Anything go right today? Ow! Ouch! Grouchy Bear, you found the magic lamp! We're saved! Where's Nephra? I'm here to grant her wishes! My sister Nephra is gone, and I don't expect she will ever return. Y you're sure she's gone for good? Well then, I guess you can have her wishes. for the Raggedies to be returned safely to their home. Your wish is granted! Ah, oh, it feels good to be home. I'll say. Okay, Fido. I bought you a brand new flea collar. Now let's put it on. Dog. I guess there was just something you didn't like about this one. Come on, Fido. 